Hello geezers, how's it going? And today, welcome back to a brand new video on the channel and I'm going to be telling you guys how to talk in a Cockney London accent. So, where do we start? Let's break it down. So first of all, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you a sentence and this is how you would say the sentence if you're just talking normal English. You'd say, Hi there, I've left £10,000 in your house. However, you need to break this down. You can't say you can't say it like that if you're talking to a Cockney accent. So it's, let's break it down. Instead of hi there, you start off with something like hello geezer, ten thousand pounds, right? So ten thousand pounds can be broken down into ten grand, and then grands can be broken down into a bag of sand. Grand, it's like Cockney rhyming slang. So instead of saying a grand, you say a bag of sand. And so that can be shortened down into bags. So instead of £10,000, you've got 10 bags. And then if you say in your house, whenever you're saying a word with a H, you don't say house, you say house. You drop the H and you can even extend that to like ass. So instead of, hi there, I've left £10,000 in your house, you can say, hello geezer, I've left 10 bags of sand in your ass. And yeah, that's how it is. That's one sentence, but there's plenty more of that. So I'm going to think of some more examples. So... Say, say you're going down to the pub for a drink, if there's anyone not in the UK watching this, a pub is basically like a bar, I guess. Yeah, it's like where you go down like to have some drinks. Instead of saying pub, there's another word for that, which is slang, which is called a boozer. You just call a pub a boozer because it sells booze, so it's called a boozer. But then you can even break that down, it's a Cockney rhyme and slang, a boozer you can call a battle cruiser. And then, say, so say if you're saying, I want to go down to the pub and have a beer. Beer can be broken down into a pig's ear. So you could say, hello geezer, I'm going down to the battle cruiser to have a pig's ear. And, that, and, that's, <laughs> and that's basically what it is. That's, yeah. So instead of like, hi there, like, hi there, hello geezer. Basically, everything you can say in a sentence, you have to break down into something else pretty much. Let me think of some more examples for you guys. So, boys, another example that I thought of is if someone's being a bit crazy, you know, they're a bit of a nutcase, you can call them, you can call them mental. And like, I'm sure that's probably what a lot of people say, like, but yeah, you can call them mental. Where if you break that down into Cockney rhyming slang, instead of mental, you say radio rental, because it rhymes with mental. So instead of saying, wow, that person's crazy, you to say that geezer is radio radio rental so <laughs> yeah it's just another example for you guys so another one that you can do is if you're trying to say money you're trying to say the word money you break that down into bees and honey so instead of saying oh, I want to get some money you can say I want to get some bees I want to get some bees and honey and the reason for that is bees work to produce honey which is sweet like money so all of these have a meaning behind them basically it's just sometimes it's hard to get but yeah instead of saying money you could say I want some bees and honey because you don't say the H bees and honey my ass the hospital the Oolaroop some, some, <laughs> I don't even know I remember there was um, there's a road um, there's a road called Wellhall Road However, you don't call it Wellhall Road, you call it Wellall Road, Wellall, Wellall, you sort of merge Well and Hall together, you don't say Well Hall, you say Wellall and then you merge them, so it's like Wellall, Wellall Road, Wellall Road. So it's, it's just like that, basically. Right, so if someone is on, so I'm, I'm going to try and break this down from an American perspective. Say someone's on, like, government assistance over there, here we call it benefits. And <laughs> here we call it benefits, and the slang word for benefits is called dole. So when, like, when you get government assistance, it's called benefits, that's what they give you, but a slang word for that is doll, but Cockney Ryman slang for that is rock and roll. So when someone's on benefits, you can say, oh, that geezer over there, he's on the rock and roll, it's outside job centre, something like that. But yeah, it's, it's just crazy how much you break it down. Like Americans would just say like government assistance, it's like government assistance, benefits, doll, rock and roll, he's on the rock, he's on the rock and roll, you know. <laughs> I don't even know, that's just how it is boys, that's just how it is. And the last example I can do, I can think for you guys is, um, say, say, um, I don't know, say you've gone and you've got your paycheck and you've got a nice hand of cash, but you wouldn't call it cash, you'd call it bangers and mash, and bangers and mash is a British dish, it's basically sausages and mashed potatoes, but we call them bangers and mash, and so when you have a cash you can say, oh I've got a load of bangers and mash with me right now, and it, there's loads of different examples like that, but Basically, that is how you talk in a Cockney rhyme and slang the London accent. So, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.